This video looks at the basics of on-site HEPA filter aerosol testing, as well as the various aerosol injection options available on priced products. Aerosol testing is used to validate HEPA filter and diffuser integrity in critical applications including clean rooms, pharmaceutical compounding rooms, and operating rooms. This testing is done by injecting aerosol, typically PAO or polyalphalin, above the filter and subsequently measuring aerosol concentrations below the filter to determine if any filter leakage or bypass has occurred. Typically, filter testing is conducted upon initial startup and with every filter replacement. In pharmaceutical applications, integrity tests are often required every six months of operation. Every filtered product from Price is supplied with an aerosol sample static pressure port, or ASSP. The ASSP can be accessed from the room side by removing the diffuser face. This quarter inch port is used for measuring plenum static pressure as well as sampling aerosol concentrations above the filter. The port is located on the lower knife edge frame and ships from the factory with a gasketed bolt installed. Filtered products can also be ordered with an optional aerosol injection port, or INJ, for easier commissioning. This 3 8 inch female NPT port is used to inject aerosol above the filter for aerosol testing. The aerosol injection port is located next to the static pressure port and can be accessed from the room side by removing the diffuser face and the 5 16 inch internal hex head plug. If aerosol testing is required on a unit that does not have an injection port, a remote injection port can be used. Remote injection ports are used to retrofit existing units that are not equipped with an integrated injection port or for convenience and accessibility. The remote injection port kit includes a panel with up to 10 embedded 3 8 inch female NPT ports that can be installed in either a hard lid or grid ceiling. Tubing is then run from each port and inserted into the ductwork upstream of each diffuser, thus allowing aerosol to be injected above the filter. Testing should be carried out in accordance with IEST standard RP CC034. In general, the process is as follows. First, Release the quarter turn fasteners and remove the diffuser face. Next, remove the 5 16 inch internal hex head plug from the injection port, connect a threaded fitting, and connect the tubing from the aerosol generator. Aerosol concentration upstream of the filter can be sampled through the static pressure aerosol sample port. Scan the filter and diffuser casing to verify overall unit integrity. If leakage in excess of the approved limit is detected, follow the diffuser and filter vendor's recommendations for troubleshooting and field repairs if needed. Finally, disconnect the test equipment, reinstall the plugs in the aerosol injection port, and reinstall the diffuser face. For more information on aerosol injection and HEPA filter testing, please visit our website at pricecriticalenvironments.com.